Yeah. You know, it's just to end his UFC career. <laughs> That's sweet. <laughs> That's sweet of you, man. <laughs> All right, on a lighter note, um, let's talk about your Filipino background. Because, uh, yeah, there's a lot of Filipinos that have been following you, but there's not a lot of information out there about your Filipino background. I mean, so your mom's a Filipino, right? Yeah, my mom was uh, born and raised in the Philippines. She was born in Manila. Mm-hmm. Uh, she came here when she was, uh, I think she was 18 or 19 when she came here. Um, and she uh, she basically, uh, she married my dad. And uh, then I was I was made. My dad is born here. He's uh, he's um, he's a Polish American background though. Mm-hmm. So his his my grandparents or his parents are from Poland mm-hmm. or European descent. I really don't have much uh, information on that on my dad's uh, my dad's heritage, but it's definitely European um, descent. And, so uh, I have, you uh, you know, and I'm born here in Brooklyn, New York. Uh-huh. But uh. You know, I travel back and forth all the time to the Philippines. I was I was raised more Filipino than anything else. Um, I I consider myself, if anybody asks, you know, I consider myself Filipino American. Awesome. And I, I was going to ask you about I, that. You you um you mentioned before that yeah you fr- you frequently go back home to the Philippines. I mean, where where do you stay over there? What do you do over there? Um. Well, uh, wow. The family over there is immense. You know, you know how Filipinos are, but. Man, I mean, the family there, I have, uh, my, my mom has six, uh, six, actually five sisters and one brother, um, two, two passed away already, but, you know, they're very, they're old, and their kids have kids, and their kids' kids have kids, it's just a, I mean, our family reunion is like, uh, forget it, it's like, <laughs> people, it's yeah. like Ignacio, yeah. and so I don't know if there's some, maybe some relatives are listening too. <laughs> but there's a lot of Ignacios, but uh, yeah, my mother is from Ignacio descent. So uh, yeah, when I go out there, I stay. My mom has a house out there too, and I stay with my aunts and my uncles, and, and uh, I just vacation there and, and visit all my relatives. It's, it's great. In Manila? Um, uh, yeah, I go to Manila in uh, Quezon City. All right. I live by by Tanasora. Oh, okay. That's a busy area. So, yeah, it's uh, a pretty busy area. It's like city like lots of pollution. Yeah, you know, so you're familiar with the uh, the Filipino traffic, the pollution, the oh hustle my God. and bustle, huh? I am familiar. Just don't stick your head out, you know, of the jeep. <laughs> <laughs> to, uh, to a lot of the... Like, uh, you know, rush hour. Can you compare the Philippines to Brooklyn to a lot of... Because there's a lot of Filipinos who don't know, like, who has never been to the States, you know what I mean? And... and at least you've been to the Brooklyn and you've been to Manila. Can you compare um, Brooklyn from Manila? Say that again? Can you compare uh, life in uh, Brooklyn to life in Manila? Like, to- um, Let's see. Well, I, I, I lived in Canarsie for some time. I mean, if I would compare it, I would say that, like, I really like the weather in the Philippines, but, you know, I don't like the cold weather here. You know, all my friends who are of other uh, descent, they, they don't experience, uh, you know, how... Uh, like the brotherhood and sisterhood that Filipinos experience, like we really, we really stick together. I'm so proud of that. True, true. Because, uh, like I said, man, I mean, uh, a lot of Filipinos have have been following you. You may not like notice it firsthand. I don't know if you, you know, we notice it firsthand. But yeah, I get a lot of requests to interview you again. And and cool. whenever uh, I post your interviews, there's a lot of comments and reactions, especially from the Filipino. Even like the boxing fan base, you know what I mean? Awesome. Like, yeah, yeah. they hardly know the Rampages or the Chuck Liddells, but they know Philippe and Nover. Oh, that's awesome, man. So, that's yeah, awesome, I mean... Just, <laughs> that's incredible. So, uh, yeah, what are the Philippine? What are, what are the stuff you love from the Philippines? Like, what's your favorite Filipino food? What, what, are, like, what, what are the stuff I love about the Philippines? Yeah. Uh, well, it's gotta be probably number one. is probably, I just love... You know, I love seeing my family over there, but if I don't have to label things that everybody can do, it would probably be uh, the food, man. That was your favorites, man. Nothing nothing compares, you know, nothing compares to some of the food that's over there. It's quite unhealthy, though. You know, <laughs> like your off season. <laughs> true, true. But, uh, you know, that was your favorite. In every different way. <laughs> what are your favorite Filipino foods? Uh, you know, I gotta choose something that's a little healthier. If I'm on season, I'll probably do the nalaga. Uh uh-huh. Nalaga Yeah, yeah, that up. is good. Um, but if I'm off season, you know, like probably after this fight, 
Yeah. Saturday, probably by probably by Sunday or Monday, Monday, I'll probably be in Queens and Rose, Roosevelt Avenue. I'll probably that's a, that's a place here in, in New York. Mm-hmm. They got a lot of Filipinos over there, and they got a restaurant called Crystals. I'm gonna be over there eating some uh, sea sig. Wow. Chicharron. Dang. <laughs> You know, I'm gonna do all the bad stuff, man, just for a couple days. How about the how about the street? <laughs> how about the street food in uh, Tandang Sora? Did you ever try the street food over there? Oh, the street. Oh, well, my mom tries to take, make me stay away from the street. Food. <laughs> she thinks I would get hepatitis or something. True, but, it could uh, end your career right there. <laughs> I really like the fried, uh, the fried uh, intestines. Yeah, man. Um, I think it's fried chicken intestines. Yep, yep. Like, uh, Isao. That would Iso? They call that Iso. Yeah, Iso. Iso. Iso no Mano. Oh, that was good. That was really good. I, you know, I try to stay away from Burger Machine and that stuff. <laughs> and you did, um. Like the fishbowl guy, you know, if, if he dips it, you might dip, dip your fishbowl in there. Uh-huh. And then he's going to dip his fishbowl in there. You know, you don't want to shake the sand. <laughs> True. But when I was a kid, I was growing up. I used to grow up on the fishbowls. Uh-huh. You know, nowadays, I try to stay away from it. I don't know if it's the most hygienic thing. Yeah, man, especially <laughs> with all the but, uh, swine flu stuff going on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, but uh, I would, man, if, if I could eat that stuff, I would. Forget it. I love fish balls. I love, I love the, um, the fried intestines. I love all that stuff, man. It's really good. Unhealthy food, but, you know, I eat Philippines when I'm on vacation, so. Awesome. And you did uh, introduce uh, the UFC to Balut. In the yeah. in the last season yeah. of the U- Ultimate Fighter show, and that's not even that unhealthy. I mean, you know, it's just uh, I think it's just it's like eating a chicken or a duck. So yep, yep. It's got some cholesterol, but I don't think you know if you're training, you know, you you need some you need cholesterol high foods. Awesome. All right, man. Um, on that note, I just want to thank you for taking time out again to talk to me, and you know, wish you pleasure, luck, man. man. My always with my shit, man. Wish you luck. Oh, oh, I I meant to ask this. From you last time, you walked into the ring against Escudero with a with a with a bomb as uh, intro music. What song was that? Yeah, uh, yeah, that was uh, that was my boy Mark. He has a, a group. Uh, let me give a shout out to him. Uh, All right. Nate Foundation. They're a group uh, in Queens, actually, actually in Jersey, in Queens. Uh, but I guess they represent New York, and uh-huh. uh, it's a Filipino rap group called Deep Foundation. Mm-hmm. Uh, 